But by the grace of God, no one was hurt, so thank God for that. A store in East County has closed its doors tonight after an elderly driver smashed through the front of the store. It's breaking news that we first brought you at 5. Good evening. I'm Riel Creighton in for Preston Phillips. And I might take him along as new at 6. 10 News reporter Jennifer Jensen is live in La Mesa with what a witness heard just before he ran over to help. Jen. Well, you can see behind me that the windows are now boarded up, boarded up by employees within the past hour. There's glass on the ground, and this is where the driver went through here along Broadway and Spring Street in La Mesa. And shoppers are now finding out the hard way that the store is closed for the evening. This is video obtained by 10 News showing surveillance video from inside the Save-A-Lot food store as the car came crashing in through the front window. Here's another look with the video slowed down. You can see as the white car enters the front of the store right into display cases of fruit that came crashing down to the ground. Suddenly we heard like a sound of breaking glass and the building kind of shook a little bit. Akrawi was a few doors down at his family's Gigi Pizza restaurant taking an order when he heard the crash and ran over to help. Once I was over with the phone, like I took the order, I hanged up, rushed outside just to see a car went through the save a lot. He took these pictures of the car as it was being towed away. The man inside was visibly shaken up. I think uh, he was trying to hit the brakes and he hit the accelerator and, uh, and he ran right through here. Miraculously, the supervisor of Save a Lot tells 10 News no one was standing there when it happened. By the grace of God, no one was hurt, so thank God for that. So taking a live look inside the store right now, you can see the skid marks on the floor that they are trying to clean up right now. And that witness, if you take a look over to the right, see this Chinese fast food restaurant? Another car actually went through here about a year ago, so this is the second time that he's had to experience this. Now, there's no update tonight on the driver's condition, but we heard he is supposed to be okay. Of course, we're going to continue to follow up. Live in La Mesa, Jennifer Jensen, 10 News.